this little area here, which it, it is, uh, oh God, this is my sanctuary. This, this is it. And my friends that we get together, they have their, everybody has their comfort zone. This is mine. And, and, uh, it's done pretty good and, and we all that we get together here and we we just ah at the at the, at the expense of saying well you know back in the 60s communes and all that <laughs> my it's not that it's it is it, it's a, it, this is my my little shrine and 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 everybody that comes here when i go okay i'll go to medulla's house I'll go to, to all these other riders, Max Stallings house. We we all they have your comfort zone that they're they're comfortable with. This is my comfort zone and uh but at the same time everybody's got their one and, and we all travel to each other's one and it's it's the coolest thing ever. The the, the whole scene is what's cool is we have our checks and balances and it's like, okay, is this worthy enough to be a line <laughs> you never think that would happen but yes it is and it, it, it's gotten back to that point to where you question everything and you believe nothing but you try to write above and beyond everything that you never thought you could that is what I think this is going towards and it's getting there it's getting there it's not redneck music now, hell, I ain't no redneck music. <laughs> Shit, rednecks. Is, that rednecks. <laughs> I changed clothes before we start this interview. <laughs> I had on I had on a turtleneck. No, I don't wear a turtleneck. Don't don't cut that out of there. I don't wear turtlenecks. But no, redneck rednecks is bullshit. Rednecks is is I rodeo, I do all this shit, and, and fine. And I did all that shit when I was a kid. What we're trying to do is legitimize ourselves at your expense. And don't forget that. <laughs> <laughs> there is, I see this resurgence in Texas, in Dallas, in North Texas, that that Austin will never have, because it's it's us, and it's it's it's. This area, and it's not, hey, can you go do this show for five bucks? No. No. Uh, they, people right there appreciate it. They're like, hey, we'll pay you what you're worth. And you don't get that in Austin, man. You, you don't get the quality of material. That, and Austin's a hotbed of music. Hotbed of musicians. But it's also a hotbed of people, you know, looking for the next meal in Dallas it's not that way it's, it, it's like wow this is cool man and the people that hear it are like yeah that's cool and they start supporting this they get behind it 100% and that I, you can't get that I don't play Austin that often fraternity parties is about it they 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 uh they got enough money to pay for for a band in that we can make a living. Uh, Dallas has places that will go, hey, yes, we'll pay for you. What's your work? And that's nice. And it's, it's not, the North Texas music scene, because of that, has become one of these, just, just, it's a very, very prolific music scene. And I see nothing but upward growth. 